welcome guys to pyroza tech youtube channel if you're new to this channel please subscribe share and comment in today's tutorial we're going to learn how to install custom edp in our vps first of all let's log in to our ssh client in my case i'm using juiz ssh you can use any client of your choice We are going to do it in two steps. First is installing the script custom ADP installer and the next one is me adding credentials or username, password, expiry date and etc. So after logging to a VPS make sure you are logging as logged in as root user. To do so just type sudo as you represent then enter your root user password I'm logged in as root user the next step is running this UDP installer script I'm going to post everything in the comment section so don't be stressed before doing so let's first update our vps so just say just run apt update yes then apt upgrade and enter that's our vps to fill it, to finish uh, all the necessary updates and upgrades yeah and um, i'm done now is to run the udp installer it's going to reboot after installation is complete yeah and that is it now let's log in again and add users still reboot is still on the wall working not that's not yet rebooted fully in here let me explain what all this is about the first one here username m m stands for add you are going to add this one you go just copy it the way it is and then for the way there is tutorial this is where you're going to put your name or username that you like and e stands for expiry date expiration in my case uh, in my case it is going to expire on december that first you can edit there uh, according to what you want i think the reboot is completed now let's log in yeah always 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 log in as root user sudo seo and then root user password mine is long 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 i can't can't cram all this just copying and pasting and then adding user adding user and press enter done now we are going to add the password this is a final 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 step password updated successfully i think we are done with all the steps and now we are going to copy our vps ip address and to do so this is my IP address. I'm going to open HTTP custom and test whether UDP is working as ex expected. Port number is one to six fifty five that five and then at user user we used tutorial. and password share then come 
antique UDP custom UDP custom take that UDP custom and connect then let's look at the logs and that is it guys it has connected successfully thank you for watching the watching this video please subscribe share and comment thank you guys